Hi friends and welcome to Crumbs from Jarad. Do you sometimes think that because of your flaws God can't use you? We who have this spiritual treasure are like common clay pots in order to show that the supreme power belongs to God not to us. Now there are different kind of vessels now and also the time of Jesus and Paul. You would have gold vessels, silver vessels, bronze, copper, wood vessels and clay vessels. There would be other kinds of vessels also. Now obviously things which were treasured were stored in gold, silver or bronze vessels. But ordinary things were kept in ordinary places. Now Paul speaks of us being these kind of earthenware. Now the image that he uses is not too far fetched because when we look into the Old Testament, we are told that we were created out of dust, out of clay. And also the prophets speak of God as a potter and we are the clay. So precious things are kept in special vessels. But he speaks here of these ordinary vessels. Now ordinary vessels could easily be displaced if they are flawed or cracked or have a piece chipped off. And so we are that kind of vessel. But now he says, that there's this treasure stored in these ordinary clay vessels. And you see this even in our villages in India today. Sometimes when the villagers want to store their gold, they don't store it in a place where robbers will search for, but they store it in the big earthenware where they keep their grain somewhere inside so robbers don't look over there. And we are that kind of vessel. We have this treasure. What is this treasure? This treasure is the Lord Jesus Christ abiding within us. We have the treasure of the Gospels. We have the treasure of salvation in our ordinary earthenware. And God wants to use us even though we seem to be flawed, cracked and pieces chipped off. And therefore something for you to reflect about. What do you think is your biggest weakness and yet God wants to use you? And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, Son and Holy Spirit. Have a wonderful day with Jesus.